Air fry peppers, or you might call them air fry bell peppers. They are ideal for dicing and cooking in the air fryer without oil and they taste absolutely delicious and they're perfect for a quick side for lunch or dinner. Hello, my name is Samantha and I'm from the blog RecipeThis.com and also the voice behind the Kitchen Gadgets podcast, Magic with Gadgets. Today, myself and my husband who will be behind the camera will be showing you the easiest of the easy, healthy air fry and instant pot recipes. The ideal for beginners to instant pot and air fryers but want something healthy that is just ridiculously easy to do and just perfect for when you're starting out with your new kitchen gadgets. And of course, this is part of our project of healthy instant pot and air fryer recipes. And don't forget to comment below with which kitchen gadgets you have and also to subscribe to our channel and join our mailing list over at recipethis.com forward slash newsletter as we do have some amazing learn your air fryer and learn your instant pot courses to help you get you started on your kitchen gadgets journey. So let's talk air fryer peppers. I absolutely love peppers when they're cooked in the air fryer. They're just fantastic and you can have them as a side dish for dinner. They can go on a southwestern salad or whatever the way you like peppers is. So first of all, I love red peppers the most. And then what I often do is I'll chop around the core because it's easier for when you're chopping peppers into cubes. And then I'll always keep the end of it as well. So then what I recommend you do is you can have it in strips as well if you want, if you just want some veggie fajitas, but I prefer them in cubes when I'm having them just for a quick lunch or dinner. So I might be having some chicken in the instant pot and then I've got some peppers to go with it. And then of course, I love the fajitas as well. So if you just want fajitas, you can just literally keep them like that instead of dicing them all up. And then go with your final strip of pepper. And then if you see, you're now done. Right, seasoning, you don't need oil. Um, because peppers are quite wet and they just really don't need it. But what seasoning would you like? I am going here with some salt. And I'm also going with some mixed herbs. I love mixed herbs. and They're a bit like in American cookery, what they call Italian seasoning. And you just add a bit from both. And then... Give it a quick mix and then it's ready for the air fryer basket. Just as simple as that really. And then load them into the air fryer basket. And then they're ready to go. You can have a check and see if you've got any big bits that you want to cut down a bit more or just go with it as it is. So if you have a look there you can see it a bit closer up to see what the peppers look like. And then in the air fry basket it goes. You want to set the temperature to 180 Celsius, 360 Fahrenheit, and the cook time to eight minutes. And then press start and you can get going. So the air fry is baked. Let's check on our air fry peppers. There you have it, just like you would expect. Uh, with peppers, they've shrunk quite a lot, but they are still ideal for a quick snack from the air fryer. I love them like this and they're so crispy and delicious. If you cook them a little bit longer, you can have them like sun-dried peppers as well, if that was your thing. So there you go, another easy air fryer recipe. So please comment below with which bread maker and air fryer you have at home in your kitchen. 
Uh, here in the Milners, uh, we have just a cheap bread maker that we got from Amazon Germany that we had shipped to us. And we also use the Philips Air Fryer XL, uh, which we've had for a few years now. And if you are into air fryers and bread makers, do head over to recipethis.com as we have a lot of recipes for you to choose from there. And all the recipes that we're mentioning in these videos, you can find over there too. Thanks for watching. We have a huge collection of kitchen gadget recipes, including air fryer, instant pots, slow cooker, soup maker, and many others. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and follow us on social media. Best of all, join our newsletter at recipethis.com forward slash newsletter. There we have plenty of principles, cooking time cheat sheets, free ebooks, and mini courses to help you along your way in your kitchen gadgets journey.